Right, as them I get ready for ride out. <laughs> Print T Sha. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So as y'all can see from the title today, we are going to be doing a little vloggy vloggy. So it's a typical work day in my life. I am currently on the HTME program for those of you who don't know. So I'm going to be showing you guys a few things that they don't show or tell you that actually happens on the HTME program. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Santina and I am a small business owner slash a 9 to 5 girly. It is after 9. So I have been up since 9 a.m. I already made breakfast and all of that good stuff. So I'm about to take y'all with me to work. So work starts at 3.30 p.m. My role is a server assistant. So basically all I do is assist the server with a bunch of stuff that you guys are gonna be seeing. So this video is pretty exciting. You guys are gonna be enjoying it. So ensure that you watch it entirely. So enough of me rambling, let's dive right into the video. So our uniform is very typical. So it's just a black top. You can either wear a skirt or pants, but I like to wear a skirt because I'm in my feminine era. So I'm gonna be getting ready now. My shift starts at 3.30 p.m. So I'm not gonna lie, most of the things that I do or that I am doing in this video today is what I do on a daily basis. I still wear makeup on a daily basis. I know that my skin is almost flawless, but I don't know, I'm dealing with people, so I like to look my best. And I'm not gonna say I don't feel like my best without makeup, but it gives a little pop. So I'm going to be wearing makeup today, of course. So it's nothing extra, just a little natural pop. No lashes, no eyeshadow, just foundation and filling in my brows, clear lipstick, and I'm good to go. I know that there are lots of persons that want to participate on the HTB program. So I have done a previous vlog before that you guys can actually stay tuned to. Hello stranger, it's been a minute since we last kicked it. And by the way, just got in town. So this is my simple beat for work. Natural as possible and nothing extra. I am not ready, so let's go to work. So y'all yeah, would think that this is not cute, but this is one of the cutest setting. It basically depicts the whole theme of the restaurant, which is a barn. But we still have a little modern side to it in terms of the service, the setting for the tables. And a lot of persons come here just for that. So, ladies, I'm about to get a few. 
So we have to fold around four types of napkins for service. So this is what I'm about to do just now. Can you imagine this bowl made out of utensils and almost twelve thousand US dollars? Unbelievable! Unbelievable! And this is where we're gonna be at in the nighttime. Pictures. Actually, they meant for this. So. This is clean. So this is where we normally stand in the nighttime for the waters to bring to tables and a second restaurant. <laughs> so we're gonna go downstairs and I'm gonna be in the wine store tonight. In addition to the two restaurants that are on the property, we also host dinners, private dinners in the wine cellars as well. So we had a party for 12 persons with a private server and an assistant. Today's lunch. Hmm? We have Patrick, Harry, today on the HCP program. And of course, how did you start working here? Was it a program? No. Oh, was it J1? No. What? <laughs> Green card. <laughs> you? Oh, yeah. That's how you started? Yeah. I Green got card. married. I got married. So you didn't start on the J1 program or H2B? No student visa. What's the student visa? I started here in New York. In the US? Yeah. Sure, for my master's. Nice. Your girl got her master's. Yeah, I guys. don't use. <laughs> I know, I know what it is. You know what it is. How about you? Alright, so. That were called uh, Jamaica mm -hmm. call center. Call center? Yeah. So did you need an experience? Um, not really. Um, we kind of used to do like gigs here and there. Um, like what? Like okay. events. Catering? Events, catering and so forth. So we have an idea of hospitality. Because mm -hmm. you know like through college or whatever you know we do some amount of hospitality um, subjects or whatever so you have a basic knowledge of what it is and mm -hmm. so did you use an agency no um, so for me mm -hmm. someone that was working here actually knew about the opening and mm -hmm. told me about it so I applied did the interview and I was successful we had to so, do an interview yeah but it was directly here, yeah. so it was after it was afterwards that I started interacting with the agency. But I had already gotten the job. So it was already there, right? However, the agency would have done the whole processing and all of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Oh. See, guys, so you don't need an agency to come on the program, okay? That's a Mr. Oxford. I never start. These are my yeah. people. Yeah. Nice yeah, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my dad about people. I set up for persons that would have made a reservation. Oh, there it is. Come on. These come back to me, not to the dish. 
Trevor, this is the longest shipping. Look at her face. <laughs> Right as them I get ready for ride out. <laughs> Friend Tisha. <laughs> Blood clean, he almost pop up. <laughs> yo, Santina, yo, Bill no man no your ride ago. Watch it, yeah. It next Sprint Tisha Douglas or mash up. Eh? You ready or what? That's right, Tina man. Charated. I go left here, you know, no. Mama never want good, never want, never want left in tea. You want a big rider, you know? Want to ride with tea. You can imagine that? You yeah, a big rider like that? You could ride with the one hand? I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Rotted. You hear the print of them dead? I say Rika. Imagine that. Rika. Oi, I say I wrong spot here right in front of me now for me go mash up, you know. Mira! Oh, yeah, no, I'm not up. Go on, no. Say hi to your camera. Hi, guys. <laughs> go out there and put them bugs, me. Let me see if you go pop up around the corner. I'm going to up and catch him people on the camera. Watch your printer. They're not setting no a trap for you tonight, man. You got you good. <laughs> really was not able to show you guys exactly what was happening at work in terms of service in the kitchen we had a very busy night so we had 70 plus people that came to dine in one of the restaurants that was just one and it's fine dining so you know that they're having from appetizers straight to dessert and other fancy stuff so while i wasn't able to actually use the phone I could only film what you guys have already seen. So that's a typical day in the life or night in the life at work on the HDB program. I hope you guys actually enjoyed watching the video. That's basically it for me. My experience on the HDB program has been absolutely phenomenal. I know that there won't be a lot of persons that will have the same experience. You'll have persons that might have regretted that they came on the program being that they aren't treated fairly they're not eating any hours and the experience is just not it's not good but i can attest it's my second year well first year on the hgp i've been here before and the experience is really good you get the hours there is no issue in terms of getting to work or anything like that so love it here so i am currently about to close out the video if you enjoy watching the video ensure that you give it a big thumbs up don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section ask me anything love to interact with you guys there also ensure that you are subscribed to the channel if you love content like this until next time guys see you in my next video bye